TB is a highly infectious disease and it is said that one patient with active TB can infect about 12 to 15 patients per year and that's a lot. TB is an infectious disease that is spread through the air. Uh, when a patient with tuberculosis coughs, sneezes or walks or even talks, the air is spread from person to person through the air. TB is spread via inhalation of the TB bacteria. So when one is sharing utensils uh, with a patient with tuberculosis, he cannot get TB from it. The best way to prevent tuberculosis is to have that person with tuberculosis treated because the moment the patient takes his medicine, his bacillary load decreases. Hence, his chances of spreading the disease to other people is decreased significantly. It is said that it takes about two weeks of treatment before the person becomes completely non-infectious. People who are most prone to tuberculosis can be classified into two groups. The first group include people who are recently infected with TB bacteria. And this includes people who are the close contacts of patients with tuberculosis, people who are immigrating from areas of the world with high burden of tuberculosis, children below five years old who, are, who tested positive for the TB skin test, people who are high risk of TB transmission, and this includes the homeless, the IV drug users, and people with HIV. And of course, lastly, people who are working or living with people who have tuberculosis in facilities like the hospitals, uh, jails, shelters for the homeless or the nursing homes, and shelters with patients who have HIV. And then the other group of people who are most prone to tuberculosis are people with medical conditions who have weakened immune systems. And this includes patients with HIV, uh, people who have diabetes, people who have uh, silicosis, or even patients who are undergoing chemotherapy or taking drug suppressants for organ transplants. Mm -hmm.